Well, it's time now for the latest in sports with Sunny Young from the Sunny Side of Sports. Hello, sports fans. I'm VOA Sonny Young with the sunny side of sports. In motorsports, the Kenyan Peter Horsey drove his Mitsubishi Lancer to victory in the Rwanda Mountain Gorilla Auto Rally. For winning the race in Rwanda and a series of World Rally events, Horsey will receive more than one million U.S. dollars in sponsorship deals. The drivers in Rwanda powered past hundreds of fans who lined the sides of dusty and often dangerous roads. Meanwhile, the roads in the German capital of Berlin have been very good to Ethiopian star Haile Gebre Selassie. For the fourth year in a row, Haile won the Berlin Marathon. His winning time of two hours, six minutes, eight seconds was more than two minutes off the world record he set last year in Berlin. Now let's go to Las Vegas, Nevada where American star Floyd Mayweather Jr. made a triumphant return to boxing after a nearly two-year layoff. The unbeaten Mayweather won his 40th consecutive fight, scoring a dominating victory over Mexico's Juan Manuel Marquez. Mayweather dropped Marquez in the second round with a left hook and went on to score a unanimous win. It was Mayweather's first fight since he beat Britain's Ricky Hatton at the same Vegas venue in December 2007. Now let's go to Egypt, where the FIFA Underage 20 World Cup football tournament kicked off Thursday. In addition to the host Egyptians, four other African teams, Ghana, Nigeria, Cameroon, and South Africa, are participating in the 2014 youth event. Ghana and Nigeria have the proudest African pedigrees at the FIFA Under 20 tournament. Twice they've been runner-up. However, no African team has lifted the trophy, which will be awarded October 16th in Cairo. I'm VOA Sonny Young, and that's the sunny side of sports. Well, thanks so much to you there, Sonny Young, and please remember to watch for the sunny side of sports each Friday right here on In Focus. Now, for more news, please go to our website, voanews.com.